Hello and welcome to 1991. We're back on the Sega Mega Drive. In fact, we've got the Mega Drive hooked up to a Mega CD this time. Uh, and unfortunately, because it's hooked up, I can't show you it. But it's there. But we're not playing a Mega CD game. We are playing a Micro Machines game. In fact, this Micro Machines game. Yes, this is the one. This is the one I remember from my childhood. Uh, last time we played Micro Machines 2, which is this one here. And today we've got uh, 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 we've got Micro Machines. There we go. So yeah, I played an awful lot of this, uh, as did uh, my sisters, as did my sisters, is that even English, and my brother and everyone like that. So we played a lot of this game when we were kids. Interestingly, uh, this was made by Codemasters, but also, also one of the companies that worked on this was Big Red Software, who, who, uh, made a game called Big Red Racing. There we go. I think this was one of the last ones they made, uh, and this was for the PC. Interestingly, uh, the specs, I'll just read off the specs for this because I got this a very long time ago. It requires a 486DX2 uh, minimum. It requires 8 megabytes of RAM. It requires a VGA card unspecified. It requires a mouse. Yeah, that, that's actually one of the system requirements. Double speed CD-ROM drive and an IPX network. So, you know, if you want to connect to a friend or whatever, you would need IPX, not even TCP IP. And MS-DOS or Windows 95 compatible. Yeah, we're talking about a very long time ago. So this was uh, one of the guys that developed this game. But however, we're not on uh, PC games. We're on, we're on this one. We're on Micro Machines. So, uh, what we're going to do is a quick tournament. Now, I don't know if we're going to have enough time to do the entire tournament. And the reason I don't have my headphones on at the moment is because, god damn, this game is loud. Um, I've actually had... Oh, I can't, I can't do that and talk at the same time. I've actually had to... Um, so we've got the, 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 the Mega Drive. Uh, Genesis, if you're American, but it's a Mega Drive. And the, the sound output is actually going from um, the Mega Drive itself straight into the chocolate bar recorder because we can't record uh, through the upscaler because for some reason the upscaler doesn't talk to the capture box. It's very, very complicated. But uh, fortunately, it's a Mega Drive 1, so it does have the headphone output. So I've managed to ramp the sound down so it's not clipping as badly. And you know what? And you know what? We're just going to get straight into this. We are going to get straight into this. And we're going to do a challenge because we, we don't have two players here. Uh, we're going to do... Ooh, we're going to do the challenge mode. Head-to-head -head is basically... Um, you have a, a series of dots down the side of the screen. And you need to get faster than the, your opponent. Uh, and as soon as you're a, an entire screen beyond your component... Uh, component, opponent, you get, um, you, you fill up one of the li little dots on the side of the screen and eventually whoever's filled up all the dots wins. Uh, but challenge is the basic mode. This is the one we're going to do. And we've got everyone here from the last game or the second game. So, you know, everyone should be here. We'll, we'll be cherry. Uh, why not? Um, we have, oh, can we, can we ch change anyone? Select anyone? No, this is the qualifying race. So headphones on because, ah, uh, can I talk? Is it loud? Hmm, I don't know. Let's, oh, it's down as far as it can go. Okay, fine. We'll just hit qualifying race and go for it. So B is uh, our go button. If we hit someone or someone hits us, we bounce. That's a kind of a cool thing. I don't know why I'm looking at the webcam because by this point, the webcam should be off. Uh, if we drive into the bubbles, well, we can't actually drive off the track. So we're in a, we're in a bubble bath at the moment. We've qualified first, which is uh, brilliant. So I think don't know if that actually does anything for the next race. Uh, we'll skip through. Oh, yeah, now it allows us to choose who we want to race. I believe everyone is ranked in order of their competence. So if we choose uh, Walter and Dwayne, these guys are probably going to end up, you know, way, way at the back of the grid. Um, let's choose Annie just because we've got another girl in the mix. Uh, oh yeah, so oh, actually, what am I doing? I'm 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 unselecting people. So yeah, I push the start button to select people. Fine, 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 fine. It's been a long time since I played this game. <laughs> Come on, um, start makes us go forward. So the idea is we fill up this uh, this sort of collector's case with cars, and the big space at the bottom is for the monster truck, which is a time trial, and it is. It is really uh, quite difficult. So I can bounce that person out of the way. If you hit someone, you, you bounce away in a direction uh, that you hit them. So if you hit them up the butt, you're going to go bouncing backwards. If they hit you, uh, you'll be going forwards. Baked beans are going to slow us down. This is very different from 
the second game. In fact, I think the first game is actually technically more competent um, than the second game. Now, these early races are very, very easy, so I should imagine we will just uh, blitz them. Same, like, I think it's 16 degrees of movement. Uh, probably a little bit more than that. Um, yeah, no, not too, too bad. So we'll just uh, scream around and kind of win, I guess. Just just uh, get our win on. Um, like I said, the first, the qualifier, ah, the big beans. The qualifier was very, very easy. You cannot fall off the track. But here we're on a tabletop and you can see that we can actually... Um, that's a really weird noise. We can actually fall straight off the track and it, um, it doesn't take you out of the race, but it will slow you down. So uh, we'll go to the next one, which is the sports car. Okay, and I think if you lose three races, uh, then you're you're out. You're out. That's it. You'll you'll be dunion rings, my friends. Ah, I was not looking looking at things. So um, yeah, there's also inertia. So if I let go of the button uh, of B, yeah, we we go on for quite some time. Now we need to get in the s ah. Well, let's just go around that and around that. Okay, fine. I was playing this earlier and it wasn't too, too bad. Ah, well, we've both fallen off, so we're not not too bad here. We're still in first position, which is great. Uh, we go down here, uh, long straight. Yeah, I do like this first game compared to the second game. If I had a choice between uh, two of them, it would definitely be this one um, over the other one. But having them as part of a collection is still absolutely brilliant. Um, so we go through here, and this is the bit that I can't really... Uh, because it's not... Ah! Uh, it's not that accurate, the old uh, D-pad. So it's not like having, um, like, a thumbstick or something. It's it, it really is just, like, you've got 16 degrees of movement, and if you don't get it, like, accurate on the first go, then... Ah, uh, it's stuck on the notepad. Then, um, yeah, threading the needle can become quite a skill quite a skill so can we get it nope okay we should be good for the next one right good yes brilliant uh we're on the uh pop we're on the last lap anyway oh you asshole pushed us out of the way that's oh my god what is the problem with this freaking bridge we were gonna win we were the chosen ones one we we had it in the bag and then not being able to line up for the freaking bridge. Oh, we're going to be second, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, that's a problem. Well, at least we're not last. You know, at least we're not last. So, Anne, uh, Annie wins. Is that Annie or Anne? I'm going to say Anne. The E's silent. It's French. Whatever. So we're still through to the next uh, round. That's not a problem. Uh, oil can alley. Yes, no problem. Uh, we still start at the back of the pack, interestingly. Now, this introduces an extra um, couple of mechanics. The first is the oil, uh, and the second is the white stuff, which is glue. You can pretty much sort of go through the oil, no problem. Uh, you do a little slidey, but if you hit the glue, you stop. Uh, the AI follows the follows the map quite, um, quite well. Oh, God. Got to narrate and remember where the hell I'm going. Um, some objects can be jumped over like the uh, like the nails but the fuses can't if you hit the fuse then you are stuffed i should probably talk less and concentrate on driving more but that would make for a very boring video um so let uh, uh, i don't I, I i i was gonna say i give up i give up but i can't give up we must race we must race uh for the honor of our ancestors and not hitting the glue like a complete uh noob yep I did have, when I was a kid, I did have quite a lot of micro machines. I don't know where they all are. I found the Enterprise the other day, which is the one that I was looking for. In fact, I might show you it at the end of the thing, if I actually remember where I put the damn thing. Um, but yeah, I had all the Star Trek uh, micro machines, which was kind of cool. I had loads of cars. In fact, they, they did um, like a little kit, which uh, you started off with like a micro machine chassis, and then you could put different wheels and stuff on it. It was really good. They also had things like um, like a little carburetor, which you could open up. Uh, was it a carburetor? No, it was a distributor. It was a distributor cap, and you could open it up, and it had like a little Micro Machines workshop on the inside. That was brilliant. And I think my brother had like the Micro Machines city van, which was a big van, and it opened up, and then you could play with your cars on the inside. It was brilliant. So Walter's lost too many races, and he is Dunion Rings, because Walter is 
dungeon rings, whatever. We don't care. What we care about is who we get to choose next, because if we choose Spider, I think Spider will, will just, yeah, rickety wreck us. Um, so at the, at the top, it's like Spider and he's Ace. And then it's Fab, Slick, Crazy, Wild, Smooth, Fair, Able, Rash, Poor, and Dire. Okay, yeah. So at the top, they've got, they've got their abilities. And I think eventually we, we would have to race Spider. So uh, we could select him like right at the beginning and uh, straight try and knock him out early on. But at some point, we're going to have to race Spider. So this is a sand level. And this is the one that I remember when I was playing uh, Micro, Micro Machines 2. I was like, I kind of remember this this map, but I don't remember this map. Um, this was the map I was remembering, not the other one. It ha it does introduce another mechanic. So apart from the sand dunes and the rocks and stuff, now we got water. And you do not want to be in the water because uh, you sort of sink down into nothingness and then you have to do like a respawn. So it's basically like falling off a table. You cannot cheat uh, by going straight through the center of the map, although I do believe some of the maps do have shortcuts. So we go straight down here, uh, we'll jump over the sand dunes, and then we'll go through here, uh, try not to hit too much stuff, get ourselves lined up for that. Um, remember there's a turn here, so lay off the throttle, and cut round here. Yeah, we're doing a lot. Oof, almost in the water, but not a problem. Not a problem. And we'll come straight down here, 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 through the sand dunes, round the bottom. There we go. Avoiding the rocks or the pebbles, and take the jump. Get ourselves lined up for that. If you pre, if you pre steer before the corner, it takes a, like a, a second or so for it to uh, line up. You can actually uh, cut corners and stuff and make yourself a lot, lot quicker. Yeah, so I think Dwayne is basically the next one that's going to leave. Triple win, bonus, beat the clock. Oh my god, this is the for the monster truck. And I tell you what, I don't think I've ever beaten this. Because it's against the clock, but it's also kind of... Um, oh, it, it's very technical. So we've got to get uh, uh, through there without sinking. So it's not necessarily like... Oh no, you need to beat the clock. It's more like, oh no, you need to thread the needle on a controller that really, uh, like a 20, 26 year old controller. Ah, Let's just take this one slow, like real slow. Uh, 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 uh. I don't know if there's a, like a quick way of doing this bit. Probably. And we got six seconds. Are we going to do it? No, I don't know if we are. Oh my God. We, oh. We would have done it had I remembered that the plants are not something you can drive through. Damn it. It's not a long course. Uh, we just don't get the monster truck as a bonus. Um, but yeah, it's a very technical course. So we're back in like the little buggy things. Are we back on the breakfast table? <gasps> we're back at the breakfast table! I think there's also... Um, so we, we can just avoid the beans. Um, this bit here with the little chicane bits, we can go straight through there, but the AI is going to try and slalom it because they, they do try and follow the course uh, fairly straight. Um, so they'll be like, no, 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 there's a slalom. We'll do the slalom bit. And we're like, oh, no, no. Okay, yep. Just had to remember to get over the uh, over the complex box, not not just... We, we're all over the place. Um, not just slam into it, which is something you can do. Uh, the waffle, yes, you can slam into it. The baked beans slow us down. Interestingly, the baked beans are the things that slow us down um, rather than anything else like marmalade. I suppose it's easier to go, oh no, these are baked beans, rather than, oh, this is a this is a thick cut marmalade for your toasty toast. Mmm, tasty. I wonder what I. Oh God, no, not the beans. Who has so much beans on their table? I must throw ourselves off the table. So we go straight through there. Not a problem. This is actually not bad. Like compared to the second game, it's a lot more forgiving in the early uh, early races, I suppose, because we don't have we're not racing against Spider straight away. Um, so we got one more one more lap. But to be honest, we haven't even seen the AI. So the AI is not even here. Uh, as long as we don't keep slamming into things, I don't I don't foresee there being a problem with this. Uh, what I do, for, I really would like to get to the pool table because I do remember that being like a fun one. Uh, how fun it is now, 20 years later, or however long it's been. Um, I don't know. I honestly don't know. 
but it's like for nostalgia's sake, I, I must see it. I must. It, it must be done. Uh, waffle. Nope. Oh my god, and the beans. We're just we're just our own worst enemy, but we're also first. This is such a difference compared to the uh, compared to the first game. I gotta say, it is totally different. So, Dwayne, oh no, buddy. You know, you're almost out. Oh, Formula One cars. <sighs> is this... Yes, there we go, Cubal Circuit. Oh my god, brilliant. It's all the things I don't remember. I don't remember this one, though. That's the problem. Oh, these are very fast. Wow. Oh yeah, we have to get... Uh, we have to get the playing card. You asshole. Right, okay. I do kind of remember that, that you can go down the... Uh, you can go down the pockets and stuff. Can we bounce you off the edge. Yeah, we can bounce you off the edge, but then we, we die ourselves. Mm, that's a pain in the butt. But now you're behind me, so, uh, you know, do one, baby. Um, bounce you off the edge. Goodbye. Ah. Oh. As you can see, as kids, you know, playing this multiplayer, we would have been like straight dicks to each other. Um, I'm just gonna... Oh my god, you bounced me off the edge. Okay, right. Fortunately, we can... Uh... Oh, we blew up. No, I didn't realise that was a thing. Um, we can kind of catch up with them fairly easily because these guys are complete tools. Oh wow, I remember the going down the pockets. Oh, which you've got to be kidding me. The objects, the objects here are, are just fantastically tricky. So you go from very easy, some of the very, very easy races, and then you get some like really challenging ones. And this is one of the uh, really challenging ones. We are, oh, you <sighs> like accuracy is not a thing, accuracy is not a thing with this controller. Um, if you are compared, uh, if, if you are compared, if you are used to ass, if you're, <laughs> if you're used to ass, <laughs> oh god. <laughs> No, I mean if you're if you're used to um, even the, even the Dreamcast controller, um, even the Dreamcast controller, it's uh, it's very different. It's a very different world. So we know there's a, a playing card. Oh my god, just hopping off the playing card just kills you. Um, and these these balls, obviously they, they don't move because it's, they're just part of the, the like 2D decoration. So they're just 2D, uh, not even sprites. They're just they're just a bit of the world you you're not supposed to interact with. So it's just like a, a large map painting, I guess. And this is like, you can't drive through this. This area is not for you. So that's the start finish line. Um, we gotta try and. Yeah. Oh. So the other two are kind of way, way behind. Um, let's see if I can really wreck you. No, but I might be able to get. Yeah, see, we're slightly faster than. Um, who's that? Oh my god. I was trying to remember who the hell that was, and then we just die off the edge. Ah, whatever. We're not going to lose at this rate. Oh, and then we have to get on the playing card. Remember not to get off the playing card, because uh, if you get off the playing card, you explode, which is uh, a thing. So we'll jump down here. Oh my god, I'm actually sweating. I'm sweating. I, I'm, I'm like, no, I went, I went the wrong way. It, it could have been ours. It could have been ours. It's not ours. It might be ours. <gasps> it's ours. We won. We won. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Holy crap. Yeah. Yeah. That is, uh, that, that's brilliant. So Dwayne is out. We've knocked another person out. Oh, poor Dwayne. And it's going to say, who do we want to race now? You know what? This game is going to carry on for a while until we've uh, knocked basically everyone else out. But... For the time being, I think I'm going to leave it there because otherwise this episode might go on for, well, quite a while. Um, you know what? If you're liking this series, uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Tell your friends about the channel because that will help us out. And if you want to see any more, you know, say, God damn it, finish a, finish a challenge or at least have an attempt to finish a challenge. And I will catch you next time. Bye.